In this Business Tech Planet video, we'll show you how to manage pinned apps in Microsoft Teams. In your Microsoft Teams application, you can change the position of apps in the left menu by clicking and dragging them to a new position. You can also remove any of the apps by right-clicking them and selecting Unpin. To add an app to the menu, click the three dots. Then select an application. To keep the application visible, right-click it. Then select Pin. You can have a maximum of seven pinned apps visible in the left menu. To change the default layout for an organization, admins can create setup policies in the Teams Admin Center. To do that, log in at admin.teams.microsoft.com. Then, head to the left menu. Click Teams Apps and select Setup Policies. To change the default for all new employees, select the Global Policy. Here, you can click and drag the apps to reposition them. And you can add new apps at the top. But if you want to create specific setups for different groups, you'll need to create new policies. To do that, click Add. Enter a name for the policy at the top. We'll call ours Help Desk. Below, you can disable user pinning, which overrides users' current pinned apps. Further down, you can add apps to the left menu. We'll search for Zendesk. Click Select. Then click Add at the bottom. We can now click and drag the app to reposition it. To remove an app from the list, click the check mark next to it. Then head up and click Remove. When you've finished setting up your app menu, click Save at the bottom. And save again to confirm. To add groups to this policy, click Group Policy Assignment. On the next page, click Add, and a pane will open on the right side. Head across, and enter the name of a group in the input box at the top. Choose the group in the drop-down. Now click the drop-down and select the policy you just made. The rank adds a level of importance to each policy. That way, if a user has been assigned multiple policies, the user will inherit the policy that has the highest rank. The highest rank is 1, which means everyone in the selected group will be assigned this policy. Finally, hit apply at the bottom. Then click confirm in the pop-up. In Teams, the users assigned to the policy can now access a specific set of applications. To remove an assignment, select the group. Click Remove at the top. Then click Confirm. And to remove a policy, head back to Manage Policies. Then select the policy. Click Delete. And click OK to confirm. That's all for this video. Please leave a comment if this helped, and hit the subscribe button for more Microsoft videos. Also, for all the latest Microsoft news, and free exclusive resources, be sure to click the link in the description, and grab our weekly newsletter.